Hello and welcome to my reaction to some more Aru Saru I. Uh, yeah, continuing the journey. Last song was an original song and it was pretty damn amazing. This time we have a cover, uh, Anima Lu. Uh, okay, yeah, I guess um, no, need, no need to translate this time around. Uh, and yeah, no need to, to say anything else, you know, I love Aru Saru I at this point. Uh, and yeah, more coming once again. I don't know how it is right now. When you're watching this if i manage to make it uh, an everyday thing but yeah i imagine at this point it's already pretty much uh, a constant thing uh in terms of releasing this uh other salary reaction because you know as i said i just want to catch up to the uh, more recent one and so then i can make a playlist and listen to everything uh, a lot you know but uh yeah link in the description for the original video we've gone into 2020 now uh also link in the description for my streamlabs and my patreon let's say this out English ones, okay. Kind of weird how the cover has English subs, but our previous original song doesn't, you know. A bit random, whatever. Yeah, of course, I saw the art in the thumbnail and outstanding as every time. Man, it looks so damn good. Yeah, animal. But we see them in the air letters. You know, the other gun up for you. Makes sense to me. Is this a full up cover? She sounds kind of different from the, the usual. Okay, it's some other tune, which as you guys know, it's not just some other fan, it's... I don't think it's... Okay. I mean, obviously I know, especially in rap, auto tune is a pretty uh, common thing. Okay, in this part, we have the other tune. She definitely sounds this one, different from usual. A bit more cute, a bit more younger sounding. I don't hate it, but yeah. I don't make a very early song where I like the use of the tune. Maybe I guess when it helps, you know, a bad singer or an okay singer sound a bit better. I guess there is some for Amelia in uh, Olivia. Yeah, she, her voice and her delivery make her sound more like a teenager compared to her usual voice. It doesn't sound terrible when it's again, but not my style. Yet. I like the part without the tune, but this part is yeah, not doing it for me. Still, listen to one in the playlist, I would say. But compared to everything so far, you know, that I would give a 9 or a 10 out of 10. Yeah. This is more like, you know, a 6 7. Shopaka. Okay. And yeah, once again, the art absolutely ascending. But I'm saying that every time, anyways. So. Yeah, alright, well, you know, not everything is going to be perfect. Even Kaf, I have uh, I had the same problem a few times, you know, with a few uh, songs with auto tune, and I don't know. I feel like some people would, you know, think I'm kind of a dumbass for saying that. Auto tune will ruin a song for me, but I'll say it anyway. It does, you know. Uh, not to the extreme, as I said, I can still appreciate it because I'm a big fan of Arusarui or Evan Kaff, but uh, yeah, auto tune not messing. That's the conclusion of this. All right. Well, I don't assume that, you know, she's, it might happen once in a while, but for the majority of her music, she won't do that kind of like Kaff once again. So yeah, I'm sure there's going to be plenty more to like. So, you know, 
Anyway, link in the description for the audio video, my Patreon and my uh, Streamlabs if you want to support me. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe and see you next time.